Hello everybody, welcome to Minutes with PJ. Today's date, March 11, 2016. Our discussion is going to be on wealth. It's found 90 times in 89 verses. In Genesis 30, 30, for it was little indeed you had before I came, and your wealth has increased enormously. Jehovah has blessed you from everything I do. But now, what about me? What should I provide for my family? Psalms 52, 7. See what happens to those who despise God and trust in their wealth and become ever more bold in their wickedness. Ecclesiastes 2, 26. For God gives those who please him wisdom, knowledge, and joy. But if a sinner becomes wealthy... God takes the wealth away from him and gives it to those who please him. So here too, we see an example of foolishly chasing the wind. Titus 3, 4 through 8, But when the time came for the kindness and love of God our Savior to appear, then he saved us, not because we were good enough to be saved, but because of his kindness and pity by washing away our sins and giving us the new joy of the indwelling Holy Spirit who he poured out upon us with wonderful fulfillment and all because of what Jesus Christ our Savior did so that he could declare us good in God's eyes all because his great kindness. And now we can share in the wealth of eternal life he gives us. And we eagerly are looking forward to receiving it. These things I have told you are all true. Insist on them so that Christians will be careful to do good deeds all the time. For this is not only right, but it brings results. The examples I give here through these verses I selected, God supplies us with our wealth. Those who trust in their own wealth are wicked and foolish. God supplied us with great wealth through His Son, Jesus Christ. Believe on Him and what He did at the cross and resurrection, and we are promised eternal life and shall not perish. As Christians, we are to go and do good deeds all the time. I want to thank you for uh, following me on Two Minutes with PJ. It's not a sin to be wealthy. It's how you use that wealth. And it's better if we use that wealth to help others. Have a blessed day and God bless.